Mr. H, how did you come up with the idea for the G-Class pedal? You've already hooked people with the single, but now this batch of double pedals you just cooked up is extremely potent. Doubles. Really? I noticed that in the pedal market, each brand has a specific feel being focused on and a certain target audience that they're hitting. There is a gap in the market when it comes to pedals. Either pedals are very loose and fluid, or they are resistant and powerful. Why can't we make a pedal that bridges the gap? I noticed that each pedal was only about 96% pure when it came to feel, adjustability, and aesthetic design. I knew I could produce a pedal with a 99% purity rate. And once I started working with Gibraltar, it happened. The much anticipated G-Class double pedal is here. Dun dun dun! I have one here in the flesh. Well, steel. But I've played it a number of times and it's beautiful. It's fabulous. It's all that it was cracked up to be. We took all the amazing features from the single version and we doubled it. We're breaking doubles. What's better than one? Two. And for all of you left-handed players out there who have been shafted, left out in the cold to die by other drum companies, we didn't forget about you. We made a left-handed version. This thing has fulfilled my wildest fantasies. Enough daydreaming. Let's check out the pedal. Both pedals have a fast touch G branded pedal board. They have a sleek, smooth surface with high performance styling for a comfortable feel. It has sculpted pillar frames with an enclosed spring tension system. The spring tension adjusts at the turn of a wheel. The tension indicator allows you to memorize the spring tension and then just set it and play. It has a G-Drive dual adjustment cam. Now what this is, it's a two-point cam adjustment that alters resistance and motion to suit your playing style. So as you can see, the cam is in the forward positioning right now. It's got a space in the front of the cam and this is a more powerful positioning that's gonna create more throw. If you want it more relaxed, we simply remove the cam and slide it back to the back positioning where there's an extra little space in the back now. Now the pedal is set up in a more relaxed positioning. And of course, it's on the master pedal too. It's got an onboard toolkit so you can make easy adjustments when you need to. One end is an Allen key and the other end is a drum key. The rock plate is an all metal plate that ensures pedal stability and durability. Pedal movement is eliminated by twin stabilizer spurs and an anti-skid rubber base. It has a helix mounting system and what this is is that the hoop clamp is controlled by a ratchet drive lever. Attach the bass drum to the hoop, pull the lever back until you've reached your desired resistance, then you're done. Once you're ready to remove the pedal, press the quick release button and slide the lever forward. Now for fine tuning of the hoop clamp, twist the tension adjustment knob on the tongue of the hoop clamp. You can adjust the pedal board height and beater angle completely independently from one another. To do so, take this cute little onboard tool kit and use the Allen wrench side to release the axle of the pedal so it frees up the pedal board. Raise the pedal board to the desired height, lock it back down, and now you can change the angle of the beater. The two beaters come with three weighted magnets each. Add or remove the weights to change the feel of the beater. Now here we have a double bagger. Yes, it's a double bagger. It'll hold the master 
and the slave. I've got my trusty magic wand right here that also works as a connector arm. And it too has its own little pouch in the bag. Zip it up, and you're ready to go. You can see it's got its own little G brand, the new logo, which we all know and love. And it also has a shoulder sling strap that can be adjusted to change from a right-handed slinger to a left-handed slinger. You saw the double pedal, it's out, it's available. I know you guys have been waiting for it for a long time and you can find it. It has the same kick, the same cool features that the single does, times two. So if you want to check it out, go to your dealer because it'll be available there. Now it's time to cook.